arson and gaming. All right, guys, back. Let's go hunt down some yeah, things in the Sierra Madre. All right, so we've already encountered the, the inhabitants of this. All right, so the medical district could be very dangerous. Well, his comp speakers have aged poorly, like the Madre, pre-war junk. The speakers emit a signal that'll set off your caller if you stay too long. There are damaged speakers and shielded ones. The damaged ones you can destroy at range. Don't get close. You can't switch them off like a radio. Alright, so we're gonna have to go a different way. Alright, let's go get Christine. Because I don't know when I'm gonna encounter the first person. Even though they're not really people, they're kinda dead after all. But I need a weapon. I need like spear or ideally a revolver. Oh, good. I can turn those into bullets if I can get some munitions. But the, the fact that an S20 gauge would... Don't go through the gate to Puesta del Sol yet. Gather the others first. So there's something... To, oh, right, there are things through Puesta del Sol. Del Sol. This is the important part, getting to these stashes. So getting to a stash can save your life. Also, look at how much health I've already lost. I need... Basically need to spend as much time trying to find, like, safe places to rest. So I, c I could go through there, but I think he shoots me instantly. Right, now we're gonna head to the police station. I think the sneaky way is to go up here, check for tripwires, look for tripwires, always watch for tripwires, because you don't know what you're going to find. Yeah, if, I, if I'm taking this real slow, it's because I don't want to get killed. Ah, oh, good shotgun rounds. Okay, that, that'll be life-saving if I can get my hands on a shotgun. Okay, laser laser pistol, that's another weapon. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, man. First time I came through here, I was actually having so much trouble trying to find anything. Turns out there's a lot of loot if you know where you're... If you actually, like, look properly. Alright, so I think one of the ghost people is here. Unfortunately. Oh, good, good, good. I can use this. Watch out for the villain inhabitants. They're difficult to kill unless you chop them apart. If you can, blow them up or disintegrate them. And this is why I've, like, boosted all my, like, weapons. Because this way, I can have a high sneak, which I have. A uh, tire iron, which is a good weapon. Plunger, which I think... I can get my hands on the right stuff. I can probably turn all of this into some fat. fat. <gasps> Caravan shotgun. Oh, thank God. I'm not dead yet. And a police pistol. So I now have... Alright, no. Three will be my police pistol. Four will be the caravan shotgun. Five. The hollow rifle. Six. That. And the tire iron, which I think is actually better than the knife spear. No. Well, no, the knife spear is really good because I can stack them and then just shock. Okay, whiskey. Always good because I think I can turn whiskey into the vending machines. It's got my back to me. It hasn't noticed. 
you gotta be real slow. And because if you do this right, you can just assassinate them. One shot, one kill. Without having to use a shotgun. They're fast. Unfortunately, until until you get into close quarters with them, they're very fast. I tap twice in the head. It's not dead yet. It's not dead yet. Now it's dead. And then throwing knife spears. And another knife spear. Just to make sure it's back up to... Oh my God. Yeah. That was forced impacts, unfortunately. Casino is the old man's collar. Anyways, there's a reason why they can't die. And I'm sure I can find the place again later. But yeah, no. I think, like, if I get up behind them correctly and tap, I think it's to, that I press E. Unlike these guys. Because I know there's a way to assassinate them. Also, having all of these chips is going to be useful because that way I can actually buy things. Right, the police station is really good for some things. There's some very nice loot in the police station. Oh, it's just, um... Alright, there's some dangerous things. If uh, You can go down that. If there's something down there that's actually worth picking up. And then there's something through this door. Watch for mines, watch for traps. Patriot's cookbook. <sighs> I have five bobby. Five bobby pins. Four bobby pins. Okay, that's a lot of bullets and another police pistol. Now, the police pistol isn't necessarily that powerful, but it's really good because it's uh, good for sniping and body armor. care. Drop that. And I think I can open this. Yeah. But that's like some really solid protection now. And unfortunately I can't sleep on that bed. Because <laughs> you can make, I think, like get poison weapons or something. Alright, this is useful because Red Roach. Search. Three blood sausages! Okay, guys, we're good. We're all good for like the next 20 minutes. 
Like, seriously. The ability to suddenly have, you know, no need to worry because we've got, like, the fattest fat loots in the world. Why is there a hard locked metal box here? Alright, I think that's two of these. Explosion plus 20. No, I don't want that. I want this. No, alright, th that could be very useful. Oh, can I go sneaky beaky like? I can go the sneaky way in. Cosmic knife, good. Toasters would be nice. I can get to that. Alright, so I'm pretty sure it's that I have to... Alright, three. That's, uh, that's my pistol. I think it's this. Is it this one? <sighs> Alright, so I could rescue dog, but I'm not going to rescue dog quite yet. Oh! Another one. More bullets and stim packs. Always good. Cosmic knives are very, very powerful. I'll open this one. More armor. Yes, guys. Armor. <gasps> more pistol. More rounds. Unfortunately. Alright, so we can, like, investigate some things. So, the inventory. Alright, so there's shotguns. Alright, so, and then dispenser report. Whoops. <laughs> Alright, so this will be useful. So, I'm pretty sure now that we actually have some apparel. Right, this is not the contraband room, but I can... Wait, does it still... Do I still have all my munitions? No, I don't. Useful, 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 useful. Useful. <laughs> Alright, so if I wanted to make some 308, I need more lead. Lead and powder are what I need. Okay. Oh, can't loot that stuff. Wonder glue. Hello, dog. Alright, steady. I think that just gives me a... Like, new item out of the vent. There's no noise on. Alright, that ch So I could either crack this... The 
destructive. Notoriously, maybe? No. Yeah. Examination. <laughs> well, there we go. Let's see what we have to deal with here. Alright, um, prohibited items. Prohibited items. Whoops, sorry about that. Click. <sighs> so, basically, no, no alcohol. This is the confiscate everything. Disengage the contraband. Prohibited items. Prohibition. Alright, oh, whoops. Right, that's fine. Prohibited items. Medex, good. Scotch, always good. Egg timer turpentine. Don't know why that's prohibited. Grenades. Buff out. Super stim packs. Magnorium's coming out of that thing now. There is another reason why. The automatic rifle. It's a powerhouse of a weapon when used. Oh, what? Wait, is this one? It's just that there's a bunch of them all over the place. Alright, hot plate. Alright, ghost site could be useful. Alright, can I make anything else? I want something that will be very powerful. Slasher. Trail mix, if I can get my hands on like anything. He's watching, waiting for yes, I know he is sitting there watching me. Oh good, I'm pretty sure I can get some rust here. Don't ask how... I just like... Slept beside it. Slept for like an hour beside a dead corpse. Blah! Alright, so there's more things in here. A fountain. Judging by the binoculars, it's entirely possible that this guy was one of the Kaisar Slage Nanners. I mean, if I if I could get to coffee I'm, or muggy, I'm sure he'd be very. Oh, I nearly missed all the alcohol. Now, yeah, lots of looting this episode. Before we go talk to Dog. Alright, and we're also going to the basement because there's some stuff in you would come below the cage. Down to where I am. Maybe you saw the letters I scratched on the villa walls. A little farther. Follow my voice. That's it. The one in the cage? Dog. I had to lock him up. He keeps disobeying me. Oh boy. Like you you have to like be able to like speed run. So if you don't speed run correctly, you're just gonna die. I think I can start making some really cool stuff soon. It's not really like that. 
Oh my. So many ingredients. If I had higher, like, survival, I'd probably start making some, like, weapons. Like, mass destruction, just WMDs. It's not as much, like, crafting, though, in this game. So I think I can return these things. Okay, whoops. Scrap metal. So I think I can turn that to lead, which can then give me some very powerful. Which then gets me closer to building weapons. More Sierra Madre stuff. Has to be a way to get my hands on my powder. That's me there on the table. The disc. My voice. Can't take any chances though. You may be some victim who simply stumbled down here. If so, can't let you let Stop. dog out. No, not yet. If you're who I think you are, you came to fetch dog. Use him to drag others here. Now I'll use you and that pip boy you're wearing. You're smart, clever. The key to dog's cage is simple. Take my voice to the cage above. Let me speak to the beast inside. Mm -hmm. Then you and I, we can talk. <laughs> so, yeah. Basic gist of what's going on here. You're learning. Sinclair is absolutely crazy. Also, I am surprised at the fact that I was able to successfully not die for any of that time. Did I actually check this tournament? Oh, Sinclair visited. holding cell. So he's the one who put all the alcohol down in the basement. Oh, right, I forgot to grab the key. It's in one of these desks. I know the key's somewhere. The key's in there, that's why. Oh, right. I remember how to play this. I remember having so much trouble the first couple times trying to come through here. I think it's... 